the Beatles wrote hundreds of iconic songs that are still popular nearly 60 years later. While many of these have meaningful and emotional themes at their core, many of them became number one hits, earning millions of dollars for each member of the band. According to Paul McCartney, they eventually made music for altruistic reasons, but the initial appeal of making music for the Beatles was financial. In an interview with Barnes & Noble's James Dond, McCartney discusses whether he writes songs for the love of music or for money. The former Beatle admits that when the band first formed in Liverpool, they played for money. They were looking for work, and being a member of the Beatles was a successful and well-paying job. It wasn't until later that we realized what we were doing was art, and there were things like muses, McCartney explained. And when we first left Liverpool, it was money. We were unemployed teenagers. Suddenly, there was a job, and we were eager to get paid and the more money we had, the better. When the Beatles became international superstars, they churned out hit after hit. Songs like Hey Jude, I Want to Hold Your Hand, and She Loves You would top the charts and stay there for weeks at a time. Paul McCartney stated that he and John Lennon would make jokes about how much money these Beatles songs could buy. John Lennon and I used to laugh, McCartney said. It was sort of a half joke. When we started getting hits and realized how much money they could bring in, we said, well, let's write a swimming pool or you need a new extension. Come on, sit down, and let's write it. So, yeah, it came from that. McCartney stated that they were eventually able to write for more noble reasons because their desires for what they wanted to buy were not too extravagant. I believe you then begin to wonder, oh, is it more noble if we don't write for money, but only for art or love? But that comes in any case, he added. It's not like it's excluded because you're accepting money, and what we wanted was a guitar, a car, and a house. That was it. That was the height of our ambitions. 